hey it's the empire don't forget to hit the like button the subscribe button and the bell icon for more videos be taking over let's go champ hit that like button hit that subscribe button right now let's go hey it's the empire geobasic empire back from boxing now nah, man the uncrowned champion the used to be undefeated champion Huey Fury tweets that he's still the uncrowned champion, man, and he beat Joseph Parker. Crazy stuff, man. Crazy stuff. Now, <laughs> Huey Fury put on Twitter, man. He tweeted this, man. He said, to go forward, you, after to take, man, you know, his, his grammar's really bad. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. I got to apologize for it. But it says, to go forward, you, after take step back from time to time. Right? I'm guessing he says, to go forward, you have to take a step back after time and time. I am the uncrowned world champion, and I'll prove it again. But until then, come support me May 12th on my British title challenge against Sam Sexton at the American Stadium Bolton. So there you guys have it, man. You know, After all that, he says, hashtag uncrowned champion, hashtag Team Fury, and he has the fist. So that's what Harry Fury said, man. Crazy stuff. Has him hitting <laughs> Joseph Parker in the face with a straight right. And uh, it's pretty funny, man. It's pretty funny. You know, he's basically saying, fighting off his back foot, you know, hitting him with that straight right. You know what I mean? Being cute. He's still the world champ in his eyes. So that's how Huey Fury feels. You know, cousin of the unified, undefeated champion, Tyson Fury. That's how he still thinks he's the uh, uncrowned champion. Now, this is some crazy stuff, man. You know, he's still promoting himself as the uncrowned champion. And you know what? I sort of like that. I sort of like that, you know? Who knows, man, next time he might come out uh, to his walk-in with some kind of crown on his head or something like that, you know. I think this is a really good publicity stunt from Huey Fury to, you know, talk about Joseph Parker. Joseph Parker has the biggest fight in boxing right now in the heavyweight division against unified champion Anthony Joshua. And, um, you know, it's creating a lot of buzz right now. The seats sold out very quickly. And if you keep talking about Joseph Parker and how you beat the guy, I mean, Joseph Parker is name right now is tied to Anthony Joshua. So you keep saying you beat the guy, people start, they might start believing it. They might start believing it, you know? Now, I thought the fight was a close fight, but I do think Joseph Parker won it. But I mean, there's an argument to be made that Huey Fury could win a fight. Um, the, the, only, the only criticism I hear about Huey Fury really was he wasn't aggressive enough and he didn't hit hard enough, you know? So he was on a rope a lot, but he was, he was countering Joseph Parker a lot. But Joseph Parker would just hit a little bit harder and he was more aggressive throwing more punches. But uh, Hiri Fury, he just didn't hit hard enough to keep him off of him, right? But Hiri Fury, he landed clean, effective punches, but he just didn't hit hard enough. He just, just didn't hit hard enough. But um, like I said, man, he thinks he's still the champ, man. He thinks he's still the uncrowned champ. And that's what really matters, you know? Hiri Fury still has a lot of fans. Uh, a lot of people liked it. A lot of people retweeted this. So, I mean, if you keep showing snapshots of you hitting Joseph Parker, and uh, you know, people start buying it, you know? People start buying it. You know, boxing... Is, uh, is having a renaissance of sorts in the UK. And a lot of people are really getting involved in boxing again. So, I mean, is it really bad to uh, lose to a guy who's undefeated, who's the WBO champion anyway? I mean, it's only one loss, right? And it wasn't like it was a, a non-competitive fight. It was a really close fight. So, Huey Fury, you know, he's trying to build his name back. I think he's doing a great job of it. I think uh, the British title in Britain is huge. Um, I think that was a good step for him to get that British title again, just to get something under his belt and then maybe defend it a couple of times. And then after that, he can, you know, maybe get a top guy to fly out by the end of the year. You know, um, if he gets his title, I think he should have one more warm up fight, maybe a top 10 UK opponent. And then after that, maybe fight, a, a, you know, a top, you know, 20 American opponent, you know, defend that UK title if the titles are being held up by the heavyweight division. So, you know, there's only so many divisions, and uh, I mean, still different division. There's only so many belts in boxing. You know, uh, people say four belts is a lot, but when you look at the whole grand scheme of things, you look at how many big name fighters there are. You know, you could, you could argue that four belts is not enough, actually. You know, um, between mandatories and all that stuff. I mean, each mandatory has to wait a year and a half. That's a very very long time <laughs> for one mandatory. You know, so when you think how many, how many boxes there are, you know, to get a shot is very hard. So, you know, I think Harry Fury is doing what he has to do uh, to build his name back. I think he's finding the best opposition he can find, you know. I mean, obviously, right now, he has to fight a guy who actually has the British title, right? So, he's not really stepping down. He's he's getting the title first to get 
uh, the people behind him again. You know, if you want to get a nation behind you, you have to get the title that represents the, the nation in the first place, which is the British title, which is a smart thing to do. That's why Huey Fury is getting the British title to get people back on his side. So I think that's a really good move from Huey Fury, man. I think he's trying to rebuild his name back. But let me know how you guys feel about these shots of Joseph Parker, though, man. You know, Huey Fury still says he's the uncrowned champion. Let me know how you guys feel about that. Like, comment, subscribe. This is the Empire. Geobasic Empire. Peace.